Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Keeping Up with Atul. Today, you're in for a real treat. I hope everyone had an amazing Halloween and a big shout out to all the Diwali celebrators. Happy Diwali. In this week's episodes, we're super excited to host our neighbor who lives right next door. This will be our very first guest outside of family, so we can't wait to get to know them better. And that's not all. I have combined this week's episodes with some extra weekend content to bring you even more fun. So sit back, relax and let's dive into episode right after my intro. Don't you go anywhere. Hey guys, I'm Atul. I'm an event planner. I love food, traveling and fashion. Each week I post videos of my wonderful and sometimes challenging part of my weekend life, showcasing traveling to places and trying new things. And I share them with you here on my YouTube channel. I believe you should celebrate life and create memories. And if that's your thing also, then hop onto this channel for weekly dose. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my channel, Keeping Up with Atul. Welcome back to the vlog everyone. I am so glad you are joining us today. We just woke up and Nea made some delicious toast that looks super fancy. It's our version of Hampton's toast that we had on previous episode. Specially made on amazing whole foods bread with cranberries and nuts. It's toasted to perfection and topped with cottage cheese, figs and raisin. Honestly, it's incredible. I'm a big fan of cottage cheese, but let's be real, I love all kinds of cheese. Wow, it's raining. Just had breakfast and watched an episode of this another series that's old, but we haven't got to watch it. Um, Guns and Gulab. So far it's good. And then I'm like, I cannot have another episode and sit home and just watch the time fly let me just get out because it's been a while i haven't been to the gym trying to be regular at the gym but just trying to find some excitement to go to the gym so right now we are gonna go well i'm gonna go to the gym Just got out from the workout, but they have brought me food, so I couldn't wait. I'm gonna stay in the car in front of the gym and eat this. What are you eating? Nugget. So you got me a sandwich, you're eating nugget. <laughs> this is how she looks like. You want to buy? Hmm. How's the fries? It's still hot though, right? And came home. While I was at the gym, Nia did grocery because tomorrow we are having our first guest here beside my our family. So it's our neighbor next door. We've been talking to them for a while. So we decided to invite them for early dinner because they like to do early dinner. Let me show you what she, we got, what she got. Tux, can you do the groceries? I got the lion. Lana. This is guava, Sierra. Roast masala. I guess we're making roast. Mm -hmm. Curry powder. Kabab chini. Kabab chini. Oh, that's the black pepper? No, that's not black pepper. That's kabab chini you put on the roast. Oh. Dal? That's not dal. That's oh. mustard. A oh, mustard seed. Brown egg. Oh, you got the cream cheese? Yeah. Parker wants to see it too. Yeah, I got the whole chicken. Oh, I got the whole chicken. Okay, what is this? This is um 
इसमें कॉलर मूची बनाए बीफ बोनलेस बीफ विद द बोन Nice. It's very rare that I forget about the desserts that I brought in home. Last week we went to the city and we had Magnolia Bakery. Two cupcakes, one we ate, one we have, and I forgot about it. It's so good. So here I am with my afternoon coffee and my red velvet cupcake. Sunday, I'm gonna use my Beast smoothie, Beast blender to make smoothie, not Beast smoothie. Let's see what we have. Yeah, I was gonna make a regular breakfast, and I said, I said let's not do it because we are we're gonna have early lunch and then early dinner. So we had um huge dinner last night. Now I made rice, beef curry, egg curry because I was craving for it uh, past few days, and I told her so she made that. So we had um, even though it was like seven o'clock dinner but we had a big feast like with kacha morich and all that. I didn't document it because we were just like busy eating. So it was so For frozen fruits, I have strawberries only. And then this is the berry blend. I have a banana, almond milk. I'm gonna add half a banana and then the half I'll eat it later. This is a pistachio spread. Shake it. Okay, secure. Ooh, my breakfast is ready. Right now, I am back at the car wash. Remember on the last episode, I told you I got to this monthly subscription of car wash. So this is my second car wash from the previous video. I've tried to come here, but every time I come, they're closed, which is like seven o'clock on weekdays. And I get home by 7.30 or eight. And then it's been raining. So whenever it's rains, there's no car wash. So they also close. But right now I got on the line. Everybody wants to get a car wash. So we're expecting the guests around 5.36 p.m. I'm not sure if I could vlog. Not meeting them for the first time, but we're gonna actually have like, you know, getting to know each other more. And I don't want them to feel uncomfortable with camera on the front of their face. Nia's actually home cooking. I just got out to see if I can get that car wash and I do have to buy a little bit of things. just went to get some little veggies that we need for salad and stuff so kachamori each cucumbers tomatoes and mustard oil and now I'm gonna pick up some tasty dessert like mishti and I'm gonna go home get take shower fix last minute thing and be ready for them. It is Sunday, 11.30, 1 p.m. We had our first visitor. It was nice. There's just a mother and son who lives next door to us the Bengali. So we had a very good chit chat and also dinner. I just couldn't vlog because not always need to vlog things. So we were just talking about foods, how foody we are, what kind of foods we like and the kid is like what 15, 15, 16. So we had conversation with the kid too. It was not like Gen Z that we cannot talk to him, you know? He was pretty much into our conversation. We were talking, he was listening. So we didn't, nobody felt left out. Even Tux and Parker joined. We left about an hour ago. We just finished cleaning up, fixing things. I just washed the dishes and now I'm trying to dry it and put it away. We brought a lot of mishti, doi, some fruits. Now we have a lot of soups at home. I'm kind of getting thirsty. 
Here I am getting my breakfast ready. In the mornings, I love to have yogurt, fresh fruits and granola paired with a nice cup of coffee to kickstart my day. It's the perfect combo to keep me energized when I arrive at the office. For some reason, the blueberries everywhere was like nine, ten dollars. You don't have to, but the yogurt has no taste. It's not sweet, so this will help. I could just put the granola there, but I'm not. It's gonna get soggy. So I'll put granola here. Whole Foods granola, so good. They're like a clusters with almonds. So this is secured. Flip it. Done. Goes in the fridge. The kitchen is finally organized and spotless. To keep things fresh, I'm just going to drop in a lemon ball to make sure the sink smells great. It's a little touch that makes a big difference. Basically, I am making the tea. Yeah, you're making No, because you're making breakfast, so... <laughs> How many spoons should I put? You should help, huh? Um, with that one, three spoons, because we put... We, we will use the condensed milk, right? Oh, we're using you the condensed milk. Doesn't, doesn't matter. Oh, good morning, guys. Welcome back to the vlog. This is Atul from Keeping Up With Atul. It's Saturday morning, and I got extremely hungry, so... And not just a little hungry that I could go on with like a coffee or a bagel or something, but I got like extremely daisy hungry. Like I need some daisy food in my stomach. I didn't have dinner last night. I had fruits. I had watermelon and guava. But that's gone. And now I woke up at five in the morning. She we switch. We switch our schedule. I'm the one who is to be up late and wake up early and she's the one who used to wake up late go to bed early so now I've been going to bed early she's going to bed early with me but waking up way early and I'm like sleeping late so I woke up around nine o'clock try to fix something in the office room and I'm like, I can't focus because I got hungry. So now I quickly made breakfast, making breakfast. She's still in process. Um, and I am helping. I put sugar on the you tea. Fold. You have to fold? Yeah. I'm talking. Okay. I gotta, we're going to use this one-time plate. I know it's not good for the environment, but I got to get rid of them because they've been here for a long time. So just fold them. Yeah, four, four. Okay. Mm -hmm. Why are we? I don't get okay, it. Okay, now you don't have to fold it. Just leave it. Okay, that's it. Why folding paratha? Paratha. What do you guys like? Paratha or roti? I'm a paratha person. Are we using this or one time? No, one time plate okay. is good. Okay, so we have one, two, three, four, five. We're two people and we have six paratha. I mean, I know I eat more than her, but I'm okay with two parathas at least. Because I'm hungry today, so I'll have two. Maybe three, actually. I don't know. Because we have tea coming up. Okay, we have enough food for a lot of people so if you guys are not doing anything come over we got extra parathas extra egg extra butter dal with beef and aloo bhaji <laughs>
Good morning, Tux. You're sitting on my seat. Tux turn around to say good morning. Hey, Parker. Parker says good morning. Happy Sunday to you guys. Uh, Parker is not feeling it today. Parker. Parker. Oh, oh. See. Anyway, guys. It's good morning. We're having breakfast today. We're having waffle egg tater tots. More like a hash brown potatoes. I have no clue how this vlog is going, but I've seen people drinking this flower from their garden and making a tea out of it. It's on YouTube. They live this in, in this exotic country, which is like mountain, and they grow their flowers, those yellow dandelion type or the wild flowers, and they make tea out of it. So I was like, ooh, I wanna try it. So I ordered them and I got them. Let me show you. It's nothing but flour and my tea. You see, I see the flowers, some seeds, some other flowers. The smell, the aroma, I just, I wish you guys could smell it. And guys, I didn't tell you, but we have our own hookah. We bought it like a couple of weeks ago and it's the best thing ever. We might do hookah tonight. This is the hookah, this is the things. Cool, tong. This is the pipe. Here's the stand for the thing to go on top. All right, so now I came back with the hookah. Let me show you. We don't need to go to the hookah place and wait on the line, especially during the weekend. Wait on the line and all that. See, turning off the light, I got a hookah vibe right here. And coming to do a belly dance performance is Tux. He is here. Can you guys spot him in this dark? Right there, Tux. Come on. Let's go. He ran away. I'm going to kick back and enjoy some hookah now. But before I go, I just want to say thank you for watching my vlog. If you haven't subscribed yet, now it's a great time to hit that button. I hope you have a wonderful day, night, or whatever time you're tuning in. I can't wait to see you next week with a brand new vlog. Until then, take care.